Good evening, everyone. It's literally midnight right now as I'm recording this. And, you know, a best idea or a better idea would be to, I don't know, go to sleep early and do a recording, but no, I'm doing it now. So, after doing my last study video of heads, I want to do another study video, but I didn't know about what. I wasn't, I didn't feel like doing body. Maybe I'll do another one, make a study of bodies. But I had a crazy idea to do a study of facial expressions because that's another thing I really, really want to tackle. That's why I didn't want to do a body because I didn't really want to tackle that one. Um, I'm pretty okay, but recently I realized my head game is strong. I'm doing well in the head. Doing most of the body is good, but sometimes that shoulder, man, those, you know, those, you know, those shoulders. Mm, no. Something's off sometimes. Something's off with them. So maybe I'll do body of torsos with shoulders and head to shoulders. Um, next study. But right now, I just want to do expressions. Like, having my head look consistent with expressions. By the way, you like this cute bunny girl? I'm not going to draw her. I'm just going to draw a random character. A brand new one. Simple. Character. Draw a head. Draw some hair. And be consistent. I think I'm just going to do one type of head side. Like one type of head and one type of side. Just like an idea and get them ball rolling on expressions. And yeah, so let's get to that. And I also want to color it, so no need to color, I just just want to color it. I'm just gonna jump right into this for the last few minutes. Um, so, as I was doing the faces, as I was going through it, uh, at the very end, the last row, I started getting lazy and start slacking. Even when I measure it, all the faces came out completely different. Now I'm talking about like the expressions, which is supposed to be different. I mean the shape and the size of the head. Although again, I measure it out, they still look different. It was very, it's very hard to do this traditionally. If it was digitally, just do one and just copy and paste, it would be so much easier, but I decided to do the challenge because, you know what, in the end, I'm 
want to mostly do this as a graphic design graphic novel all my faces are not going to look the same regardless um so yeah but it was worse with the last roll, the second one, the first head, because I got so tired. The the eyes was too close to the ridge, but ridge of the nose. But I'm glad I did it because I have I can see what I can do because I usually don't feel like I push my faces far enough. But I feel like I just give me an idea of what I can and can't do, and when the eyes are too high. Oh. <laughs> anyway, um, of having showing subtle emotions to. A very extreme emotions so it gave me like that that map that layout of an idea I could do more and also more expressions as this is just happy sad rage and disgust those are the three ones I did I didn't do really do sad I think yeah I think I did sad but anyway so well I definitely did happy I think it was disgust or something like that I really don't remember I think it was surprise like shock that yeah, not sad it was surprise, surprise and shock Surprise! They didn't look very surprised. Like, well, shock didn't look very shocked. It just looked same thing as the first one. Um, so I feel like I should have pushed that one more too. But I didn't that. And using the markers in this cold weather, it's not when I did this it was still wasn't that cold, but it was still chilly. And sharpies has such a small, strong smell that it's very difficult to do it in closed indoor space. You get dizzy real quick. So yeah, but that's about it for this. I think, but I'm happy for, well, most, well, partially happy with what I accomplished that, that day. <coughs> <coughs> and I should go, but before I go, um, I think this is a good for some, everyone to try to, you know, to see how they can do it from very subtle to very extreme, so lining it up, you know, to so practice your expression. Expressions, drawing expressions. There you go. For your characters, even though this is just a random character, it's not even my official character, but when you're doing your official characters, you know? So that's it. Gabby out. Alright, so it's getting really late, so I'm stopping right here with the coloring. I might finish this off camera. I'm happy with the coloring. Um, I think I will tell you, I think I told you in voiceover um, how I feel about the faces overall and expressions. But for now, that's it. It looks kind of like old man right here from the camera from this angle. But when I'm looking at it, it doesn't look like old man. I don't know. But anyhow, yeah, so I'll probably put this up. Whoops, wrong one. <laughs> probably put this up on um, Insta. But check me out there. Check out my website too. I just sold my whole world. Not really much, just my desk. How messy it is. <laughs> Um, but I don't organize it anyway. So yeah, so check out my website, my Insta, Tumblr, whatever. Until then, next time, subscribe, like, leave a comment. Bye!